What is up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy, Triple Threat 88 here, back with another fishing video. We are going to be showing you how to catch stocked channel catfish. We're gonna be going over what to use, how to fish it, and we're gonna be showing you some big catfish that we're gonna catch tomorrow on the GoPro. So before we get started, let me just go over the basics, show you guys what you're gonna need and how to rig it and how to fish it. So let's get right into it. Let's head right into it. I'm gonna show you what you're gonna need and how to rig it. So first off, you've been, you're just gonna need any rod. It can be a bait caster. I prefer to use my spinning reel when I'm catching catfish. This is just an old Shakespeare reel and rod combo. You will see tomorrow that you actually do not need a whole rod because tomorrow I'm gonna be fishing with my cousin Jonas for catfish and sometimes he uses rods that are snapped and he'll pretty much have one eyelid, but he'll still catch catfish. And then you also need a hook. It can be any size hook, but you want it pretty small. This is a really good size that you're gonna want. Very important, a bobber. You really need a bobber. This just helps to know if you have a fish on or not. It can be any size bobber, your personal preference. Last but not least, you need hot dogs. Right here, you just have some Nathan's hot dogs. These are the famous ones. You can literally use any hot dogs. They're really nice, but hot dogs literally work best for catfish. That's all I'm saying. All right, now that you know what you're gonna need, let me show you how to rig it up. We got our fishing pole set up here. Got the line going through all the eyelids. Got our hook right here. Let's tie up. I prefer using a fisherman's knot when I'm catching my catfish, but you can also use a polymer knot or any type of knot that you use. Just like that, you're gonna wanna tie it up. Let me show you that. Get a, get a close up on how good that knot tying job is right there. Boom, pretty good fi fisherman's knot. What you're gonna do with your bobber, depending on the lake that you are fishing, you're gonna wanna set your bobber to the height that you would like. We have figured out at the lake that we fish all the time, Ellis Lake, that all these catfish, these stocked channel catfish, they stay up shallow, uh, probably around four to like eight feet deep. That's where they're hanging out. And this bobber technique is very good because when you use a bobber, the hot dog is not gonna be sitting on the floor. And then that makes the catfish, when they come up, they're gonna come up and bite it and take it. And therefore you'll get a lot more hook sets this way. So you want it right above the bottom. So I prefer, uh, the lake that I'm fishing, uh, and the depth that we're fishing, I'd like to put my bobber around two to three feet. So I'm gonna just take my bobber, put it up here at the top. There you go. And then you got, you know, two to three feet all the way down to the hook. A lot of different cat fishermen can use a lot of different types of baits, but for stocked catfish, for stocked catfish, not natural catfish, stocked catfish, they love hot dogs, guys. I'm just spitting facts right now. You just wanna take a little bit off, probably around half an inch, three fourths of an inch, rip it off. I'm gonna take your hook and put it right through the hot dog, just like so, just have it a little exposed. And that's pretty much the setup. This is all we use. It's really simple, it's easy, and you can catch some big catfish. And as you will see tomorrow, we're gonna catch some big ones, so be ready for that. I can't wait to get on the water tomorrow and show you guys and catch some big old catfish. So make sure to stay tuned and uh, we'll see you tomorrow morning. All the way over here. Joe, Joe, yes. dude. I'm gonna Joe. drop my phone Joe. in. Hold on. Oh, butter bud, butter bud. Joe, Joe. Are you ready, Joe? Yeah. Joe, Joe, yeah. he's big, he's big. Dude, the ball came off. Joe, Joe, that'll, that'll Yes! How to catch stock channel catfish just like that, folks. Literally five minutes in, it's that easy. Just like that, we got the catfish pole set up right over there. I came over here, so I just started bass fishing, throwing a little spinner bait on the old bait caster, caught this little guy. So you could pretty much fish for bass and catfish at the same time. It's super fun this way. Nice little guy. My bobber's down again. My bobber's down again. Right here, all you gotta do is just tighten that drag. All right, let him take it. Boom, set that hook. Set that hook, just like that. All right, Joey. All right, he's coming up, he's coming up. You wanna tire him out a little bit? All right. Try it, just wait for your chance. You don't want him coming off at this point. He's fighting hard. They like to death roll. 
Jonas comes in with the net and gets them just like that folks the same technique we were teaching you just cast her out there let her sit and just like that we got ourselves a nice channel catfish let's go right there as you can see right through the top of the lip that is exactly how you want it i prefer having a net for this because when we came out here the first time we did not have a net and we lost a lot of fish because of that right there waiting for the catfish and we caught another bass right here on the old spinner bait nice little guy honestly for this lake it's a really good size shoot bud okay okay just caught this guy the catfish are biting see ya bud shoot joey do you have one jonas has got one on the small rod Get the net. Wait, do you have one? Yes, get the net. Hold up, you're hooked up to mine. I still have one. Get Shoot, he's, I have it. Joe, Joe, he's right there using the same technique on the mini rod, folks. Bring him up right here. Got him. Attaboy. Yes. Let's go. Out of boy, Joey. Just like that, folks. Third catfish of the day. Joe has a fish on. I have to slowly do it. Look at this pole he is using, folks. The eagle this ball just, packet. This just season. goes to show you do not need expensive equipment to catch catfish. At the beginning. Oh, he does. He does. Shoot, bud. Shoot, bud. Whoa. Whoa. Get him, Ty. Get him. Oh. Oh, let's, let's go. go. There we go. The Eagle Claw Packet, boys. The yeah. Eagle Claw Packet, Joe's specialty with the snap draw. Yeah. There you go. Catching channel catfish right there, folks. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. I had an awesome time out there with Jonas and Ty catching all those catfish. I really hope this video helped you guys go out there and catch stock channel catfish. I know this technique works. Go out, try it for yourself. If you do catch fish, make sure to send me pictures and text me and let me know in the comment section down below or on Instagram. Let me know if the video helped you guys. Thank you so much for watching and we'll catch you next time.